Hey, my name is Paul, and I'm going to show you how to make quick and easy Google Forms for the math classroom in two parts. Part one, I'm going to show you how to easily make equations, and in part two, I'm going to show you how to take those equations and push them into a form. Here's an example of a form that I created, and you can see I've got all the wonderful things you could possibly hope for. Um, and this was all very easy to create thanks to this wonderful add-on called GMath. So step one, really, is to find this add-on and install it. Um, it's kind of hard to find in the Chrome store, but if you just Google this phrase, it's the first thing that pops up. Find it, install it, and you're ready to go. Um, once installed, if you want to make a form, you actually start in spreadsheets. So here's the spreadsheet that I started. Here are the equations you just saw in my form. And the way I got them in here is I go to a, you know one of the cells, I go up here to add-ons, and since I've installed GMath, I've got this option, GMath for Sheets. If you haven't installed GMath yet, this won't show up there, but if you install it, there it is. And there's all kinds of options here. Right now, I'm just showing you how to create a math expression. So if I click on this, after a few seconds, this little box shows up that says Enter Latex. And if you know what that means, go crazy. But if not, there's all these pre-built formulas down here. So pretty much anything you want, if you click on it, suddenly the code for it's going to pop up and I can adjust it however I see fit. So if I click preview, I know I've got to change this lowercase a and b to be what I want it to be. Click on insert an active cell and then that equation is showing up in my cell. Um, what you get over here on this left side in the cells are actually image files, so these can't be edited, but they can always be deleted and then re-entered through the latex form over here. So any equation you want, anything you want, you can do it here. Um, in part two, I'm going to show you how to take these equations and push them into a form. So I hope you join me, and thanks for listening. Bye.